Hi there. Okay, today we're working on a badge reel holder. And, and this is what the badge reels look like, and I get them on Amazon. Lots of medical staff or anyone requiring badge entry into a building would use one of these for their ID. So that you could have your badge attached to that and open doors without removing it. So what I do is I take these wooden discs and they fit perfectly on there. Let's maybe start with putting on our guidelines. So I have a 16 segment stencil and it's perfect because it just lines up at all of those edges. We've got our center dot there and now we'll just put in our lines. And then we're just gonna take a ruler and bring those lines to the center. Okay, so there's our center. Well, that's got them all across. So this right here is our center dot. Okay, here's our color palette for making this beautiful badge reel. We've got Liquitex Basics in the titanium white, in the dazzling metallics, glorious gold, purple pearl, teal. In the Decoart Americana, we have desert turquoise, Indian turquoise, purple pizzazz, and wild orchid. Putting in the number Using the number seven and the titanium white, we're gonna put a center dot on there. Let that dry and then we'll do some dots around. And we're gonna start by going in with glorious gold and we'll want a 0 0.5 millimeter tool and we're just gonna go around with dots here. Desert turquoise, and we're using the 3.5 tool here. And let's just try and get try and get a swoosh in there. So we'll use the 0.5 millimeter tool, and we'll create two dots above that desert turquoise dot, and then a third one on top of that, and we'll do that all the way around. And now we'll use a very fine tip tool to create those swooshes down between the Indian turquoise dots. There, very nice. Okay, so I guess we'll get some of that wild orchid in between those two. And I'm just using the 0 0.5 millimeter tool here and then turning to the small end to drag that swoosh down. You can use a fine point tool if that is more comfortable for you. And now let's use the small end of the yellow tool to drag down some tiny swooshes on either side of the wild orchid ones. I really feel like the middle needs something and so I'm gonna put some metallic teal from the dazzling metallics uh, into the center using the number five tool from the happy dotting company now we're gonna top dot those desert turquoise dots with the Indian turquoise using the S2 tool, two millimeter tool from the Happy Dotting Company. And now for the last of the dotting, we're going to put some purple pearl dots at the base of those white swooshes and we're using this the S2 tool. And I think we can call that done. Okay, let's get a coat of varnish there on the front, shall we? 
I have found these wooden discs. They're very thin and they can be tricky with the UV resin and it depends on a couple of factors. One, I have found that adding the varnish beforehand really helps. And the other thing is my first UV lamp was 120 watts and I ended up purchasing one that has about 36 watts I think and that seems to have helped because before my pieces were cracking and part of it was I think because it wasn't sealed and part of it was because the wattage was too high on my UV resin lamp. Okay, we'll let that dry and then we'll start the UV resin process. So the next thing we're gonna do is get resin on the front. And we just wanna get it right to the edges and we have to work quickly because we've got light on it. Using a lighter or a small torch here will help to get the bubbles out. Now I'm putting it under the UV light for about 180 seconds, three rounds of 60 seconds. As long as it's not sticky, when you've brought it out, then you've dried it. Okay, let's take a look at that. That's after the first round of UV resin. I'll let that cure overnight before adding another coat. While that's curing, I hope you'll consider subscribing. I truly appreciate it. Okay, let's get some more resin on here. And then let's get our top, shall we? Okay, we are ready to put this badge reel together. So I'm going to use both Gorilla Super Glue and I'm gonna use E6000 as well. Way more than enough. And now we're just gonna put this guy on there. And how do we want him oriented? I guess like that. And there it is, our beautiful badge reel. Isn't that lovely? You could wear that on your uniform and have your ID badge on there and whoop, you open the door, just like that. And it has a hook on the back. And look at that resin shine, love that. Okay, here's our finished badge reel. And look at that. Oh, I love the resin on there. Beautiful. And that's stuck right on there with that glue. Okay, and easily washable. Another unique project done. Thanks for joining me. And remember, keep on dotting.